Hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, hey, girls. How are you? How's it going? Hi, teacher. Oh, how's it going, guys? All good? So far, I'm good. Great. Good. How are you doing with your flu or, I oh, know, your headaches? I remember you said you have a migraine. Who, teacher? Later. No, teacher, I'm asthmatic. Oh, I'm sorry, yeah. You're asthma, yeah. <laughs> asthma, 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 asthma. Yeah, There's, that's a weird pronunciation. Hello, Carla, how's it going? How you doing? Okay. Hello, Marilena. How's it going? Good evening. Good evening. How's it going? Ah, uh, it's fine. Um, uh, the fish vacation. <laughs> On vacation. So, well, vacations are over. <laughs> okay. Vacation is over. Just Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Today, today we have a. I have a lot of exercises ready for you. Um, so we can continue. Well, first of all, we're going to recall some information about the previous topics, you know, we, we have talked about. So get ready to participate. I'm just still preparing some things here that I have to make sure I have opened as we speak. It's a lot of content, so give me just one second. Just need some things open. Okay, so I want to hear you guys. I have to hear you. We have 20 minutes as usual at the beginning of the class to get to know uh to get to know Okay how you have been going. Um, I need all of you with your camera on. Josue Aguilar, welcome. Please turn on your camera. And who is, oh, Melissa. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening, Josue. So, in, in, a, in a moment, I, I turn on my video camera and on my way to home right now. Oh, okay, okay, good, I understand. But only 20 minutes or 10 minutes. Maybe. Melissa, Melissa is having some problems getting in as many at two. Okay, guys, so to start the class, to break the ice, I will throw the first question, okay? The first question will be, what did you do on your vacations? Simple question, simple past, okay? So what did you do on your vacations? For example, on this vacation period, it was five days, I spent my time at home with my family. Actually, if I remember correctly, um, on Sunday, we, we took the kids, we took our three kids to, our, um, to my wife's parents. So my in-laws, my in-laws, took care of the kids on Monday and Tuesday because my wife had to work. So she worked Monday and Tuesday and then she was off um, starting Wednesday. So they spend Sunday evening, Monday and Tuesday at their parents' house, at their grandpa's, I'm sorry. So during that time on Monday, I was working here alone at home the whole day. On Tuesday, 
as well I was working but on the computer on Monday I cleaned the house I washed the dishes I washed the clothes I did a lot of things I, I showered my husky I have a husky so I showered him and on Tuesday evening we drove to our to my in-laws house with Max Max is my dog we for the first time we took Max on the car the car finished with a lot of hair you know a lot of hair even though I shower Max still you know the, the car ended up really bad really dirty and you know that's what it takes that's what it takes having a dog it's, a, it's like having another kid you know so and after that on Wednesday on Thursday it was my my oldest son's birthday he became 11 on August 6th and we came back on that same Thursday evening we came back home Friday we did nothing we watched TV we spent the day together as a family and during the weekend I spend it as well just having fun with the kids, you know, preparing things for Monday, for today, because they started again their um, school, their virtual classes. So that's what I did. Okay. Any questions, any words that you didn't get of what I said? Yes, me, teacher. Uh, what is the meaning of in loss? Excellent. Good question. Thank you. Alida. So let's start getting into the English. Okay. You can say in laws referring to your parents from your family. Your in laws. There's an apostrophe here. Hmm. It should be. Or it's. Ah, oh, it's in Spanish. I'm sorry. My kid uses this computer sometimes. So, sorry. Okay, there we go. My in-laws. So, we went to my in-laws. It's like suegros. Okay. Um, so, that's, uh, that, that's like diminishing the word father-in-law or mother-in-law. Suegra, suegro. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Any other? Any other word that you heard from me? Okay. Not a problem. So it is your turn. Let's see. It is your turn to speak. So, Aleida. Can you select one of your classmates? Um, yes, teacher. Um, I don't know. Uh, Gabriel? Okay. Ah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Hey. One, two. What I, did. what I did do on my vacation. What did you do on your vacations? Oh. <laughs> well, all the week, all the week, I'm, I'm working uh, because we have much, um, much egg, and we need to sell because. If not, we had to lose this product. And, and my Sunday, um, I watched TV and I bought my dog. I have a uh, a doll, her name is, his name is Muñeca. It's a pastor alemán. 
Uh, I eat watermelon, a big watermelon. And I enjoy with my son and with my parents. Uh, this is my, this was my, that was I did do. Okay. Well, I didn't get that part. Okay. So, great job, Gabriel. Great job. Nice try. Can you select somebody? How long? How long? <laughs> Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Great job. Okay, Jacqueline. <laughs> Thank you, Gabriel. <laughs> You're welcome. Before you answer, <laughs> you answer, Jacqueline, can you start correcting your classmate? Sorry, teacher? What is wrong? What is wrong among this that I typed here? What is the mm -hmm. first mistake, the first area of improvement? Mm. Let's see, all the week. I'm working. I am working. I'm all working week. all the week. All week. I'm working all week. Now, one thing. What is the grammar tense that we are using, guys? Are we talking? Oh. That's it. Past. Simple. Past. So think about it, Jacqueline. Think about it twice. Okay. I was. Impossible. I was working. I was working. Yes, I was working. I was working. That's past progressive. Very good. Yes, yes, I was working. That that works. That works, okay? So let's see. I was working all the week. Does that sound right? All the week? All week. All week. All week. You can say all week. You can say the whole week too. Try to use some more advanced, I don't know, uh, language, let's say, uh, the whole week, okay? Because we have much, I didn't get this word, Gabriel. Huh? No, no entendí esa palabra. We have much. Uh, eggs. 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 Okay. Eggs. Um, eggs. You sell eggs, I got it, okay. All week. Continue, Jacqueline. Because. Because we have. Mm, many eggs. Yes, we have many eggs. We have. We still have. Oh. oh. Yeah. We need. Isn't it we have? In past, yes. Okay. We have. Now this, much eggs? Many eggs. Many eggs. Real good, many eggs. And we need? Need it. Need it. Very good. We need it to sold. Hmm. Sold. Hmm. Okay, we need it to? To sell. Sell. Oh, sell. Oh. Sell. Okay, now there's something missing here. We need it to sell. We need an object. Anybody? Anybody? An object? To sell them. Excellent. We need it to sell to Pluto. Excellent. Because. Okay, then we have a comma. If not, oh no, no, the comma goes here. If we not. Because if not, or if we do not. We do not. Then, because if we didn't, uh -huh, we will. Okay, now here, we're talking in probability, possibilities. So let's see, because if not, we, okay, this is complicated. He's talking yes. probabilities. So we, we would have 
Ya vieron uh -huh. eso. We have lost. We take lost. That we will have lost the verb in past. We would have lost. Okay. Does anybody remember this topic? Yes. We'll have, okay. Yeah, that's the perfect conditionals. We would have lost. Okay. We would have lost. No, hubiésemos perdido. Okay. We would have lost this product and y ahí me quedé. And my Sunday. And my Sunday. And Jacqueline? Last Sunday. Last, um, last Sunday I watched. On Sunday. Or on Sunday. Good, Carla. Yeah, that's what I would have used. Last Sunday I watched TV and I... Bet. Bet. Huh. Bet. But he said bet. Yeah, bet. 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 Mm. Is this correct? Can somebody correct me? What is the past of bad? Okay. But is, is, is the same, no, teacher? Is the same? Okay. No. Let, let me know. I could be wrong. I bath my dog. Okay. And, but, and, and but I ate. Ate. And I ate, ate, and I ate watermelon. Watermelon or a watermelon? No, that's it, right? I ate watermelon. Okay, and let's leave it there. Okay, good. Simple past. So, what is the what is the past for bath? Is it regular? It is. Right? Like that, bath, 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 bath. I don't know. Bath. Good job, Jacqueline. Great job. Okay, Jacqueline, it's your <laughs> turn. It's your turn. Oh, Why? I finished my tortilla. <laughs> ah. It's a simple past. Yeah. What did you do on your vacations? Okay, I I was resting with my family at home from Monday to Thursday. Mm -hmm. I watched my car. Okay. I cleaned my house. Mm -hmm. I bat my dogs. Mm -hmm. And I invest my time with my family watching series on Netflix. Okay, good. Anything else? Anything else. That's it? That's it. Excellent. Great job. Okay, select somebody please from the audience. Um, Carla? Hey, Carlita. Hi. Uh, the whole week I... Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, come. Okay, please <laughs> correct Jacqueline, okay? I was resting with my family. Uh, and I was at home resting with my family. I think that's good. Yeah. At home from Monday to Thursday. And I watched. Uh, watch. And. Okay. And when I watch. Like I watch. I feel where the world watch. I, I clean my house. Okay, wait. There is a mistake. What? I watch. I watch my. Watch. Watch. Uh, watch. Okay, I washed. Washed. Yeah. I washed. 
Wow. I watched my car, I cleaned my house, I bathed dogs, my invest. In that? I invest my time with my family watching series on Netflix. Okay. Uh, I spent. Is this correct? I, I would prefer to say spend. spend. Said you could have said. You could have said spend. Spend my time with my family. But, okay, invest. It, invest it, it, it's not wrong. Invested. 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 Okay. Third rule of the past, right? Invested my with my family watching series on that. But it's falling. Alvin is falling asleep. Move on, Carla. What did uh, your vacations? I worked uh, from Saturday to. Friday, I think the whole week I worked the whole week and the week when at the nights of the whole week I spent my time watching a TV with my grandma with my grandmother and the weekend I relaxed I saw a few movies and uh, hang out, hang out with my family, kid at home, just that. Making a mistake. Those are Hi, thanks. Great job. I worked on the week, okay, on the nights, the whole week I spent in I spent. I spent my time. Or, yeah, I spent my time with my grandma watching. I missed it. I missed this. I watching movies. I think you said with my grandma and hang out with my friend. Hung out. Hung out. Okay. Great. Hung out. Hang out. Right. And hung in the past. Good. Ah. Okay. Good job. Okay, guys. Let's move on. So what is next? Now, today the plan is for you to speak like crazy, okay? So let me look at the plan here. I have to stick to the plan. Now, I have still a question. Uh, we're still missing a few minutes from our first part, which is the warm up. Uh, the first 20 minutes of the class are used to um, to break the ice, you know, for you to get accustomed to the English again. So, do you have any grammar questions? Any question that you you were thinking about it before the class today? Do you have any questions? Any new words that you have learned during this time? Or any Spanish word that you were like? Oh my God, in the class, I'm going to ask the teacher because, you know, I have this in my mind and I have to ask him how to use How do you say, how do you say desvelado? Oh, good, good. Okay, you can say sleepless. Sleepless. Yeah, good, sleepless. Okay. You can also say overnighted, overnighted, overnighted. And you go from one night to another. But if you have drunk, if you have drunk, okay, and you have a headache, that's called Hanover, like the movie. Hanover. Resaca, okay. Goma. <laughs> <laughs> Goma, that's right. Okay, any other question? Good question. Come on, guys, this is your time to ask any questions. Remember, there's no silly question. There's no silly question. So make any questions you have. How do you say corralito? Corral. Para bebés. Oh. Mm. Uh, hold on, hold on. I got it. The stroke? It's a stroke. Hold on. Or the what, Alvin? 
had it. I... It's, a, it's a, a word in French, I think. In Diru. Yes. No, he's talking about the corral. For baby. Yeah. Hold on, I have it on the tip of my tongue. I search a playpen. Playpen. That's not sure. Hmm. Yep, mm, that sounds complicated. Playpen for baby. Playpen? Yeah, that could be it. I knew there was another word. Another word, I think. I read it on the book, actually. Um, Playpen. Oh, the stroke, the stroke, the stroke. I can't. Oh! I'm going to put it on the parking lot. Francisco okay. owed you an answer. Francisco Adrian. As soon as I get it. Okay, Corral. Okay. Yeah, because La Cuna is something else. Okay. Okay, any other? Cradle. Cradle. That's the word that I was looking for. Cradle. Si. It's cuna. Yeah, that's Cuna. Cradle. Okay. From the cradle to the to the creep says the song. Okay. Uh huh. What else? That's it. Okay. Good. Let's go with the class then. If you don't want to talk, I'll make you talk. Okay. On the first part of this lesson plan that we have today. We need to identify the elements of the marketing mix, but first we need to finish one topic, one topic that we had pending from the previous unit, unit one, we're about to finish unit one today. Just by making this a uh, little dynamic here. Let's see, where is it? Here it is, okay. So let me start the presentation so we can all be on that page. Okay, the car. Okay, here we go. Let's go with the last part of your lesson. This is the last thing we, we did. We gather, we were supposed to gather vocabulary from the iPod excerpt, remember? Okay, so now we have some vocabulary that I will give you. It's on your book on page 16. This is the last part, unit one. So the following are strategies, strategies to handle the decline stage of a product. The first one is lower prices so i'll give you some examples lower prices refers to giving offers so for example if you have oh girl i'm sorry hold on if your product is not being sold as you want okay you have to offer discounts and in marketing which is the next oops the next step that we have in marketing, it's known as discount pricing strategy. Listen, strategy, strategy, strategy. Okay, so you offer a discount. Let me give you an example. I'm selling shoes. I'm gonna offer the typical offer, right? You can buy two pairs, two shoe pairs, and then you pay one and then the half of the other, right? One and a half shoes. That's what you paid for. Uh, par dos. <laughs> yeah, par dos. Uh, you also have many other uh, companies, actually. Who's the most known? Easybuy, I think. Easybuy is always, always have this offer. Okay, ad hoc. Yeah. A, a brand. MD? MB? MD, yeah, MD as well. So. The next strategy, we're talking about, yeah, exactly, we're talking about when the product is dying, I mean, is this the last thing you want to do? Offer discount. Like open. Right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and you have innovation, a new idea, 
creative thoughts, creative thoughts, and you have to become an entrepreneur again. You know what is an entrepreneur? Anybody? Entrepreneur? Yeah. Emprendedor, empresario. Excellent. And so you, you have to think as an entrepreneur again and start reinventing your product, okay? Give a new idea, a fresher idea. You can also change the packaging of your product, okay? Make the product more appealing for customers. What is appealing? Appealing? Attractive. Attractive. Very good. Make the product more appealing for the customers. It's like the package was brown, you know, so let's change it to pink, you know, or purple or a yellow color like this one, like this yellow, okay? They will go like, wow, that's a beautiful color. Those might be uh, beautiful shoes, okay? The last thing you want to do, and this is the last step of the decline stage, and is discontinuing the product, the discontinuation. You have to stop manufacturing the product, remove it from the market if that's necessary. I mean, if you cannot do anything, to resurrect, let's say, to bring it back to life, you have to remove it from the market because, or else you are selling, you are losing money. You're losing money. And the last thing is co-branding, which is what we were talking about, right? Marketing of a product under two or more brand names. Uh, a good example of this is having iPod, I'm sorry, Apple, uh, with Nike, they had a marketing strategy for a product, the iPod, the iPod, they sold the iPod with the idea of Nike, you know, in bold. So Nike was like, okay, if you buy this pair of Nikes, we will give you a 40% discount on an iPod. You can have an iPod for a hundred bucks, for a hundred dollars, if you buy these Nikes, on 150. So that's another example can could be, um, for example, Adidas and Real Madrid. Adidas and Real Madrid, which is what you were talking about last time. Yeah. That, the strategy is is inter is, is very smart. Um, smart because you have to buy the new shirt, the new jersey every every year. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, because every year the the jersey changes for the the new season. Changes. It changes for the new it changes. Okay, it changes. Yeah. Totally. Okay. So that's co-branding. Those are good examples, actually. Um, what other example? Can somebody else give me another example of co-branding? Michael Jordan in Nike. Holy mother, yes. Michael Jordan. The Jordan. Do you, do you remember the Air Jordans? Air Jordans? That that happened. Yeah. Michael Jordan, yeah. The Air Jordans. People didn't know the shoes. They didn't know that those were Nike shoes, you know. Those were Air Jordans. So, wow. A lot of history there. Okay, now, all of these steps are, for example, when you have a stock of inventory. You know what is a stock of inventory? Somebody else, give me an, an opinion here. Can you? Let is me... the product? Uh, that are available to sell? Yes, it's the, the products that you have on your storage, right, on the inventory. So you, let's say you have a thousand units. You haven't sold a thousand units. So something weird about the eggs, Gabriel. Gabriel, if you can turn on your camera, please. Uh, Gabriel was talking about eggs and something interesting about X during this whole pandemic, the COVID-19 pandemic, is that X prices went up because there was a huge demand for X. I went to the supermarket twice and didn't find X. Too many, I mean. Yes, we, we, we have an X because the demand uh, is up. It's higher. Yeah, it's higher. Okay, in we uh, maintains the price, low price. You kept you kept the low prices. We kept uh, low prices. Good. And the competence, uh, 
the prices of the competence went up. Keep up. Yes. Yes, it's true. They went up. That is true, actually. Um, well, what did you do with the hens? Did you were you forcing the hens? Estaban forzando las gallinas. Were you forcing the hens to produce more no, eggs? No, we can. <laughs> uh, the, the hen. Uh, how do you put it? One eggs a day. One egg a day. Yes, only one, one egg a day. Wow. We have uh, one million a and half. A million and a half hens. Oh my. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, uh, approximately uh, two thousand uh, two hundred box of egg. X boxes. Okay. Wow. Um, I have a question. How many roosters do you have? How many roosters do you have? How many roosters? No, we have no. We haven't. You don't have roosters. Only hens. Yes, only hens. Just hands. Oh my God! Interesting. Interesting. Okay, guys. Now, great job. Thank you, Gabriel. Okay, let's move on. Teamwork. This is your task right now. Okay, you have to select one of the following products on its decline stage. You know what? Let me select somebody. Uh, some someone of you. Let me see. Maria Gomez, could you please help us and read the instructions? Uh, select on the select uh, one of the following products on its decline stage due to the whole COVID twenty nine twenty no, COVID nineteen. COVID-19 COVID pandem pandemic and discuss possible strategies for strategies your team could implement and the advantage advantage it will bring to the company. Okay, number one. Choose. Choose. Number two? Yes. Uber. 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 Furniture. Thank you. Aha, uh -huh, Maria. And cookies. Cookies. Keep going. Oh. <laughs> Fries. Fries. Uh huh. Clothing. Excellent. And Candies. Candies, okay. So I thought about this product before the class. Think about it. During the pandemic, who needs shoes? I mean, I stopped working on March 11th. I don't need shoes. I don't go. Uh -huh. I don't I need shoes. Okay. I don't need Uber. I don't need Uber. You can't go out. You can't go out. You can you can Uber. you cannot clothing. clothing do you need clothes you need clothes right now you're at home okay furniture do you need furniture right now no no what about cookies yes yes cookie, yes cookies. really for maybe for, for it to eat to eat excellent to eat gabriel candy you need and this are yes. sorry now i want you to think for, my kids. for the kids do you want your kids to be hyper hyper right now <laughs> yes i don't was entertaining <laughs> okay no no <laughs> oh okay what about fries fries now fries is not just potato chips it's all Everything like churritos, Diana, right? Mm, yes. Right. So, one of these on its decline stage, one of these products on its decline stage. So, you have to think about it. For example, shoes. The product is dying. 
on this pandemic is March, April. So four, four months, four months without sales, without sales, four months. Teacher. Yes. I have a friend that, um, who works in a, in a shoe companies and they, and they are, um, home office now. And she, she told me that many people is buying shoes and they are upset if not received uh, his shoes on time. They are not receiving the shoes on time. Wow. That's a problem with, with? The Cons in consumers. In yeah, consumers. No, that's a, pro a problem with the distribution channel. Remember? Distribution channel. We talked about that. Yeah. They have to work. With dealers. <laughs> yes. Okay. They have to reconfigure that. So, I will speed you split the in groups and you have to select one of these products and prepare your strategies based on what we saw before. What are you going to do? Are you going to offer discounts? Are you going to offer co-branding? What are you going to do? To save, to save your product or to sell, to sell that, that batch, okay? So let me take a picture of this. So again, that's like the main question, okay? What are you going to do? Hey, what are you going to do to sell that batch of uh, declined product? Keep an eye on this. The product is declined. Okay, so Uber, Uber, you can do it. I, I actually, that happened. This already happened. Uber drivers are using innovation. Think about this: innovation to save from com, com, from the competitors from the competitors in drive. In drive, I think is the competitor the competition of Uber. They are innovating. So think about it, discuss on your group, and then you tell you tell the group, you tell us what did you do, okay? I'm going to be doing groups right now so you can work together, okay? You will have to work on this topic. Any questions? No? No. We're going to be in four groups, okay? Let's do it. The invitation. Okay. I'm going to check the photo. What are you going to do? Sell the batch of the client product. Oh, the question, right? I didn't send you the question. What are you going to do to sell that batch of declined product, for example? So, as Gabriel said, you have some product that you need to sell. 
okay? Yes, but what product that we have? Which, we need to choose one of them? Yes, you have to choose between shoes, furniture, cookies, fries, clothing, no. candies, or Uber. Uh -huh. Or Uber. Okay. okay, think about it. Uber doesn't have an inventory, right? It's not a product, it's a service. But nobody, service. nobody's using Uber. So what do you do to, right. move, to move the money, to get money? during this time that people is not using Uber, for example. Okay. Okay, let me go with another group. Any questions? Any questions about the activity? No. No? Okay, let's do it, guys. You can do it. What can to do for try to raise this product? Do. Maybe, um, to oh. do. Try. Maybe Five. maybe co-branding, co-branding hmm. with the companies of clothes. Maybe, but it's one. I know it could be maybe two for one. Yes. Because we need uh, um, res res rescatar to rescue. No, rescue. 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 Uh, our our money so get back get our money back get our money back get back our money back okay traer de regreso nuestro dinero get get our get our money back get our money okay get our money back yeah get our money back. the phrasal verb will be is get back okay and it's back. Well, study this study this alvin Phrasal verbs. Phrasal verbs are separable or unseparable. So get back is separable and you can add an object in the middle. Get our money back. Back. Okay, good. Get our money back. Okay. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, good job. Do you have any questions about the activity? Um, um, no. What? No. We, select, we select one product. Selected? Okay. Selected one product. Which one? Selective. Which one? Uh, choose. 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 Tell them. Very good. Okay. Keep going. You're doing great. This is an awesome group. Okay. Keep going. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Gabriel, I don't... But, but even, the, even... There are, another, there are uh, another cattle, like the maybe Shane or another apps that uh, buy a uh, clothes and shoes. Oh. Other plurals, another singular. Uh, sorry, other, other. Other. Other apps, other what companies? No? Okay. Yeah. Other okay. apps. Mm -hmm. What, yes, I think. what is your product? Do you have any questions about the activity? Yeah. We choose a, a sell a, a shoes, right? Shoes? Oh. Yes, shoes. Okay, yes, so we, yes, we think it's difficult in, in this moment to uh, buy a, a, a pair of shoes. Because for the pandemic, right, it's difficult because you we don't have to, to time to, to try it, right, or to go to the... Oh, you don't have the option to try? The option to try, yeah. Yeah, so... It's so hard. I want you to think, I want you to think not as a customer, as a company who sells shoes. Okay, so what would you do? if during this time, you know, you can sell shoes. So the main complaint, you have the, the problem, yeah. oh, sorry. the main complaint of the first is, oh, you know what? I cannot try my shoes. So I'm not going to buy shoes until I can try them and see them in the mirror. You know, if I like them, I'll buy them. So what, yeah. what are you going to do to move your product, okay? okay. What, okay. which, which one of the five strategies are you going to offer discounts, 
innovation, remember? Yeah. Okay, keep going. Great, okay. great job. Keep ah, okay, yes. Yeah. Um, maybe yeah. in, in the... Hmm. Mm. Okay. You're still thinking. Yeah. I think in the strategy. <laughs> I have an idea. An idea. What's the product? What product did you select? Furniture. Furniture. Okay. So remember, you have a stock of furniture that you need to sell, and nobody's buying. I mean, I don't need furniture. So, yeah. are you sure? Yeah. Uh, our strategy is, for example, desks and chairs and air conditioner for adapt the house to home office. To adapt, to adapt the house for home office. Perfect. That's a good strategy. Now, what are you going to offer? Discounts, co-branding, innovation? Co-branding. Co-branding with who? Co-branding with, with, with each company for, for, I don't know. <laughs> um, go working with the with with companies. Which companies? And, oh, or... and, and for be employment benefit, for buy. Okay. Buy buy uh, furniture. So this counts as employee benefit. So if you work at a call center, you can get a big discount if you want a specific chair. No, for example, in my where I, I work in Kimberly class, uh, the company gives me uh, one uh, one hundred and fifty dollar for buy my my desk or chair, and the the strategy is uh, share companies uh, good companies to offer my my products uh, that the company give the the employee. Hmm, that's a good idea too. Okay. Okay, good. I don't know. Think about it. Uh, that's an, uh, that's one thing that many companies do, actually. If you work, for example, at Dell, let's say, a call center, just to name some, someone. Um, you work at Dell, you can buy ergonomic, ergonomic chairs with a discount, you know. And then both logos go on the commercial, let's say a TV commercial, you know, Dell and Capri, for example. I don't know who produces chairs. So they go brand and they go together on the marketing strategy. Okay, you're doing good, continue. But give your arguments, speak. Alayda, wake up. Okay. I'm awake, teacher. <laughs> uh, Unice, okay, ah, there you go, she, she moves, okay. Okay, keep going, guys. You only have five minutes, prepare, prepare. Okay. I think about like um, how do you say mascari? Mask. Mask. Maybe uh, a different kind of, of shirt and maybe you can use for the pandemic. I don't know. Um, Teacher, how do you say ropa deportiva? Okay, you say sports clothing. Sports clothing. Clothing. Sports clothing. Oh, you can also say sport wear, sport wear, W-E-A-R, wear. Sport wear, sport. thank you. You're welcome. So many people do exercise at home, you can create a uh, necessidad to sport wear at home. I don't
Ricardo. Ay. Hello. Your ideas for this question? Sí. No. Okay, no. what what's your product? What is your product? Clothing. Clothing. Yes, clothing. Clothing. So what's the problem? You are not selling enough, you are not selling clothes. What yeah. kind of clothes could you sell during this pandemic? Mask. Masks, okay. Good. What else? What about what about bed sheets? Bed sheets? Ah, uh, bed sheets. Bed sheets, um savannas. Pillow, pillow covers, pillow covers. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So you could actually promote this product. If you are not in shirts, you're not selling pants or underwear, you could sell something else like masks. Yeah. Okay, that's a great idea. Okay, let's go back, guys, to the main session. Okay. Time's over. Okay, I think we're all back. We're 17 tonight. Um, Gabriel, I need you to turn on your camera, please. And just before we move on, I'm going to ask for your name, okay? Go ahead and open the roster. There it is. Okay, please say here if you are here. Carla Eugenia Molina Barraza. Here. Marvin Josué Aguilar. Here. Ricardo Alexander Rodríguez. Here. Hello. There you go. Present. Bertha Present. Patricia. Patricia. There she is. Alemán. Thank you. Ismenia Abigail Trejo. Ismenia, please turn on your camera. They have it. Here. Thank you. Okay. Here. Um, Here. Xiomara Hernández. Here. Thank you. Alvin Jose. Here, sir. Thank you. Maria Elena Tamayo. There she is. Here. Okay. Here, <laughs> Eunice de la Paz. Here, teacher. Excellent. Jonathan Alexander Castillo. He said he will be with us after 9 p.m. because he was coming from his work. So. Let's leave it pending. Um, Jacqueline? Here. Guardado, thank you. Jose Ernesto Molina? No, Jose Ernesto Molina is not here. Okay, Melissa Ivez Aguilar? No. I see you, thank you. Gabriel Alexander Alvarado? He is, okay. Gabriel? Gabriel, there he is, okay. Gabriel, can you say here, please? Say here. Okay. Here, teacher. 
Thank you. Right. Saida Carolina. Here. Oh, I see. Okay. Here. Thank you. Francisco Adrián Martinez. Here, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Maria Soledad Gomez. Here, teacher. Excellent. Vanessa Alexandra Ortiz. Vanessa is not with us today. Okay, she's not with us. Let's go with Aleida Raquel. I'm here, teacher. That's good. Thank you. Okay, guys, let's move on with the topic. So, who's going first? Who's going to go first? I need to hear you guys. You have to talk. So, let me know, please. Uh, let's move on. Who wants to start? Nobody? Okay, Alvin, give me a number between one and five. Five, okay, excellent. Your right or your left? Uh, my left. Your left, okay, one, two, three, four, five. Jacqueline Guardado. Okay. Oh, Francisco, take the notes. Francisco took the notes. Francisco took the, oh, notes. took the notes. Okay. Cool. My group. Let's say that you were on a meeting in your job. Francisco took notes. Francisco wrote the minuta. Francisco wrote the minuta. You know what's a minuta, right? Yes. <laughs> From a meeting. Good job. Okay, Francisco. Francisco, you are mute. muted. 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 Sorry. Okay. Uh, we work about uh, of choose. And uh, we are agree with uh, the strategies. One of them is uh, make an attractive discount for the customers. And number number two, if you buy some some shoes, you can take a different item, another product, uh, as a complement, like a t-shirt, shirt, uh, clothes to be comfortable uh, at home, and another. Uh, yeah, that's that's only. That's maybe. All. That's all. Maybe uh, the clothes or the t-shirt, shirt. Uh, have the name of the brand. Number three, go strategy, use the social network for announcements in, in social medias like Facebook, Instagram, uh, and all, all, all of that. Uh, number four, co branding and hire a company for delivery service. Okay. Uh, like uh, uh, the famous uh, brand, uh, Uber, Uber, Hugo. It may, Hugo, maybe uh, we hire uh, another company. Uh, Global. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like the idea. So, what's the main problem? of your product not moving during this pandemic is that you said it's not necessary it's not necessary it, because it, it, you don't have to uh, to go out you don't have to wear from your home you don't have to wear maybe uh, we we bet for a, 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 a segment i don't know we bet a segment of population that uh, they they make uh, exercise at home, or they want to comfortable to be comfortable in in home. Comfortable. Repeat. Comfortable. 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 There you have. Okay. Great job. Comfortable. Okay. So you say we. Okay. We work about of shoes. We, we work about we shoes. Work. 
I think... Sport shoes. <laughs> Good. Let's let's take a look at your grammar really quick. Okay, we worked about um this purpose. Okay. We worked on. Okay. We we work on shoes. On shoes. On shoes. And we are agreed. Okay. And we agreed. And we agreed. Past. And we agreed with the strategies. Okay. Okay. And we agreed that. Here you could have said the best strategies or the best strategy. Sorry, the best strategy. Strategy is to make, what's wrong here? Is to make an attractive discount for the customers. Okay. Okay. If you buy a shoe pair, if you buy a shoe pair, you can take another item and so on. Great job, actually, I think. A shoe pair. Offering a discount is a, is a great, opportunity now going beyond who else was in the group going beyond what am i saying somebody going beyond oh my god sorry oh. <laughs> going beyond another gendo forward moving forward forward going beyond yendo mas allá going beyond uh who else was in your group ¿Quién más está en el grupo? Alvin. Okay. Gabriel. 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 Okay, good. Amy. Uh, yeah, Jackie. Good. Guys. And Jacqueline. Beyond with this thing of the shoes. We said that one of the problems is that you cannot try the shoes. The situation is this. Uh, the shoes are a vanity product. Okay. So uh, we need to, uh, to attack this idea because uh, if they see a price, a uh, attractive price, maybe in his brain, he has to, he have to, to think, hmm, if I, if I take this opportunity, I will um, arrepentirse, I will regret, regret uh, for don't take this, this chance. So we have to, 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 to work this, this idea. Excellent, good job, Oblin. Hey, third person, he has to think. He have, no, he has to think. Yeah. I, I will regret it. it. I, it. Will regret, I will regret it later. I will regret it later. You didn't say it. Good job. So thinking about the option of trying the shoes, what else could you have done? Other than the discount, maybe innovation. How would you apply innovation when you try to sell a product that is on the decline stage? Uh, me or anybody on the group? Jacqueline, Gabriel, Francisco. So again, the problem is that the customer cannot try the shoes. Oh, well, innovation. Mm. Oh, we need to create the, net, the needer, this product. Ah, okay, let me put it this way, Jacqueline. I'm calling you, Jacqueline, I need a pair of shoes. Nike black number 10, number 10. Sorry, teacher, I can't hear well. Okay, I'm calling you on the phone. Jacqueline, I need a pair of Nikes, black, number 10. What can we do? I want to try them. I want to try my shoes before I buy them to you. Mm, maybe the strategy uh, of um, this, 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 this store, uh, Sanborns, you can pay in six months the, the price of the product. Oh, okay, that's a plan uh, payment method. Okay, good job. Okay, I was thinking about, okay, as, as a company, okay, 
let me send you the shoes with Uber, with Hugo. Let me send the shoes with Hugo. You try the shoes. When the delivery man goes there, you try the shoes. And if they fit and you like them, you stay with the product, okay? If you don't like them, you send them back. We will send you another pair if you want. So it's mm. like innovation. I don't know, I don't know Rick. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we live in El no. Salvador. <laughs> that, that's a good idea. If you don't like uh, the shoes, you can return return them in a, in a two days. That's a return policy. You know who's doing that? Return policy. Yes. You know who's doing that? The people who repair cell phones. The cell phone repairing companies are doing that. They just send, uh, yep. the guy bring, comes to your house, they take your cell phone to the repairing company, and in one day, they bring it back. The same guy from Hugo brings back your cell phone, asks you to try the cell phone, and then you pay. Well, in El Salvador, if I send to you a pair of, of Nikes, maybe <laughs> you only, uh, you put in your, in your in your feet, take the picture and and that's all. You, uh, you will you you will you will put that in Facebook saying, hey, I I buy this this shoes, but the yeah. truth is not. <laughs> it's difficult with with this culture. Our culture, culture, yes, good. Okay, culture. Uh, and repeat, but. But. but but okay Jacqueline culture culture perfect okay thank you who's next Jacqueline um Jose Aguilar Jose Aguilar. <laughs> thank you okay Sorry. yes talk to us about your product in your group the, okay our group talk talks about the same product you hear right we talk about shoes okay so um we we thought uh, when our good idea uh, or the innovation and we are agreed to create an app and with this app we uh, uh, sell our shoes with the advertising with a popular person or yes, a popular person to uh, a famous person, right? To El Salvador, like uh, I don't remember the name of that that lady. Um, mm. Luciana Sandoval. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Shoes. Yes, Luciana Sandoval. And I uh, yes, I think that we can use the R A uh, um, R augment reality. You can hear that. You can use her image. Yeah, your image, and you put your in your feed with your cell phone in the app, and you uh, you look your in your feed the shoes that you really like, it, right? Mm -hmm. in, in that in that case, uh, when you you see it, you can really um, uh, the feel the sensation, right? Excellent. To really need it to really walk in the moon with that shoes. Excellent. I like that. Well, marketing. That's like marketing, yes. Innovating in marketing. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Who did clothing? Just to close the topic, who did clothing? Oh, uh, um, let me see. I don't know. No, who um, did it? Who? Oh, yes, with uh, closing. Um, that's what you did. Uh, oh, repeat it. I, I don't understand a, a little bit. So, I'm looking for someone who did clothing. Ah, clothing. Okay. Uh, we did okay. it clothing. You did clothing, Xiomara? Okay, so what's your strategy? Yeah. Well, we have uh, our product was clothes. And we talk about innovate that sale by occupying strategies like lowering prices and, Lower price. and shall we not for it? And shall we offer as if you buy two products, the third <laughs> it's free. Okay. Okay. Um, Saida mentioned something about it. You were talking about 
Yes, if the company uh, products cloth, dress, uh, blouse, they can change product. Uh, they can produce mass, mass? pilot, pil mm -hmm. mass, mass, mm -hmm. mass uh, pillow, pilot, Pil no, no. pillow covers, pillow. Uh -huh. uh, pillow covers, or bed sheet. Uh, a bed sheet. Let me tell you something. Great job, guys. This is reality. Um, I have a friend who produces women underwear. Women underwear? Silene? No? Silene? No. Okay. They produce the underwear for women. But with the whole pandemic of COVID-19, the sales went down. Supermarkets are not selling underwear. So they thought, let's change the product. Now, there, let's produce masks. Let's produce bed sheets for the hospitals. So they started massive production. The government was looking for masks, you know, for the um, surgical, the surgical mask, and also for the bed sheets and pillow sheet, pill, pillow covers. So it worked. It worked to sustain a few months. It didn't work that much, but in the end, you know, that's what you have to do. Great job, guys. Good job. Let's move on. Um, to continue, well, that's the that was the, the last part of the unit one. What marketing strategy you are supposed to use um, if a product is on the decline stage? I'm trying to look for the next presentation. Give me just one second. Where is it? It's up here. Oh, here it is. Okay. So now we have to move on. That was the, the product life cycle. Now we're going to talk about marketing. That's unit number two. I just prefer this for some reason. It's blunt. Okay. Okay. Let me share with you the presentation so we can move on. Oh, that's not it. Sorry. Hey, by the way, I send you a survey so you can uh, complete it on the on the group, on the WhatsApp group. If you haven't done it, please give me feedback. Tell me what you think about the classes so we can always be improving, okay? So the next topic is about marketing. Who can tell me what is marketing? What do you understand about marketing? Ventas, sales, sales. Sales, okay. So we're gonna talk about sales. Somebody else, what do you think? Marketing, sales. Is the strategies for Re-innovation to sell product and promotion this product. Okay, good. Uh, Abigail, for object or ING, for innovating, for creating. Okay. To verb on its base form, to innovate, to create. Got it? Okay, yes. Yeah. Good job. Thank you. One more person. Marketing. What is marketing? I like marketing is about for P. Place, product, promotion. Ah. <laughs> Come on, you read the book. <laughs> <laughs> no, because I I studied I studied it. You studied it. Listen. I studied it. Excellent. Good Gabriel. Hey Gabriel, cada vez que lo corrige usted repite, me llega. Así me agarra el feedback. Super one. Yeah, yes. I started it. I started it. Do you hear, guys? I started it. Great. I started it. So you started, started administration. Started you started, started administration. Started 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 okay, good. Let's move on. Let's go with marketing. This is on unit two, page 19, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, so let's go first with the objective of this class. 
let me see who's here around us. Uh, let's go with Saida, please. Can you read the objective of this class? Yes, identify the main element of the marketing mix of a renewed national product service. Excellent, thank you. Repeat, Saida. Identify. Yes. Identify. Identify. I identify. Excellent. Identify. Then you said more a mix of a renowned. Ren this is not easy. Renowned. Renowned. Excellent. Renowned. National. National. Renowned. National. National. Product. Okay. Good. So look at this picture. We have business, we have a plan, right? And that's all that is about marketing. A business so, plan. A business plan. So talking about marketing, let's go really quick. I will split the class one more time so you can discuss these first questions. What do customers want from a service or product? How is the product you sell different to the products of your competition. So, Gabriel, your X, the X that your company sells, what is there different to the competitors? Uh, what is the granjero? In, 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 in our case, we, uh, we characterize, we how to say in English, our characteristics or we are we, we are of the, of the product we are we, we are fresh fresh, fresh freshness the freshness, freshness. or product i like that yes. we oh. sell we sell freshness product Fr okay fresher so guys fresher, uh, fresher. here excellent gabriel here, guys, you will use comparatives and superlatives. Do you remember? Okay. Our company is better than the competitors because we offer um, bigger, bigger products. For example, we offer fresher, fresher products or price. We offer better prices, lower prices higher prices, you see, comparatives, okay? Uh, do you have any questions? Let's answer these two questions. You only have five minutes in your group. Please focus, focus. Answer these two first questions so we can warm up, okay? Okay. Really quick. Vamos a volar ahorita, okay? Let's go. Teacher, what happened with me? Let me see what's going on here. <laughs> Thank you. Saida, you are not assigned to a group. Let me assign you right now. Okay, there you go. Francisco, uh, you are in mute. No, muted, muted, just muted. You are muted, Francisco. <laughs> I forget. I for okay. 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 Bye. Okay, Francisco, tell us what have a, your your uh, brand for being uh, more special than another, hmm. another brand? Uh, the, the questioner, what do customer want from a, a service ah. or product? Okay, I, 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 I think in, in the question to Gabriel and 
en huevos catalanos. Uh -huh. Ok. And what okay. do customers want for a service? ¿Qué es lo que queremos los consumidores de los productos y servicios? Ok. We want uh, quality. Quality, mm -hmm. totally. Quality. Warranty. Uh, quality. Uh, Warranty. Uh, price. Mm -hmm. Price. Better yeah. price. A good yeah. location. Good accessibility. Location. Accessibility. The place. Okay. okay. Yeah. And uh, the. And a good promotions. The forms to uh, the ways for uh, for pay the product. Because sometimes sometimes you you prefer uh, paid paid cash or uh, use your credit card. So. Uh, yeah. That's a that is important to me. Payment <laughs> method. Yeah, but in some method. case, when you pay pay with um, cash? A cash, you you have you, a a more uh, discount with the product. Exactly. Yes. You have what a, you prefer? You have what a, you prefer? Quality yeah. or price? Quality. Mm, quality. Quality. I, I prefer quality. Yes. Yes. Okay. Is, 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 uh, cheap. It's more important. Yeah, it's more yes. important. It's the quality most is more important. It's the most important. Perfect. Good okay. Quality is high price. But we cannot, we cannot, we cannot buy a quality with low price. Mm, depends. <laughs> In Black Friday, yes. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's a, it's a liar. It's a lie. It's a lie. <laughs> because, because the, the empresas, how to say empresas? Companies. companies. Because the company, company uh, Um, quality, lower prices, good flavor, fast. When we talk about food, Uber, yes. you said you said fast and safety. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. Safety. I think. I think. Yes. I want safety. It's important. Remember the same question. What do customers want from a product? What do they, what do you expect from a product? And service too? Or service, uh -huh. What do you expect? What do you want? Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. Okay, what do you want from a service or a product as a customer? A product quality, lower prices. If you talk food, a uh, good flavor. Mm -hmm. And if you talk about service, for example, Uber, you want to be safe and fast too. Safe and fast, okay. Time. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Keep thinking. Keep thinking. I'll have to go to another group, okay? Okay. okay. It is, um, it's important. Yes. To, to, uh, yes. to return to buy if you uh, have a good experience. If the people are dying with you or uh, you feel good with this thing. Yeah, that's correct. To give more information about product, to yeah. give, to give uh, instruction about product. The product, okay. So guys, what do you expect from a product or service? What are your expectations? What do you want from a product or service? A good quality and low prices and a good attention with this company or I don't know. Okay. Now do you do you sell any products? Anybody? Carla, Jose, Abigail, Patty? 
Uh, right now, my sister and I uh, have a a little, I don't know how to pronounce emprendimiento. Entrepreneur, okay, entrepreneurship. Entrepreneur about the, the digital illustration. And, mm -hmm. <laughs> and I don't know how to, you can repeat the question, teacher? Yeah, I mean, what is good, I mean, what's better compared to your competitors? Do you have competition? Yes. We have a, a, a lot of competition. Uh, so what's better from your product or your service? The, the, the quality because my sis, my sister uh, is a very drawer and the, uh, the other, the other comp competitors only uh, draw, a, I don't know how to say the bath quality and my sister, uh, Draw uh, the draw. Draws. 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 Uh, como, como, how do you say? Uh, como, ay, no sé cómo decirlo en español tampoco. Like, like, like. <laughs> como bien así minucioso, por si. Detallista. Uh -huh. My sister is very detail oriented. Yeah, my sister is very detailed with the with the image and the picture and and also the the people see that and and just that people notice that people know and, and people notice that excellent I like that okay guys let's go back great job Okay, we're getting close, closer. We're getting closer to the last part of the class. Guys, you need to, well, let me see your hand. Have you, or do you remember comparatives and superlatives? Did you study that already? Do you know about comparatives and superlatives? Yes or no? Comparatives, superlatives? Yes, yes. Okay, so biggest, if bigger, the biggest. There you go. Review that. Check that. Okay. Let's move on. Check comparatives and superlatives. Let's continue. So now that you have answered that question, what customers want from a service or product? Um, some of you were talking about lower prices, quality, time, delivering times. Um, I think something very important is to get what you expected, to get what you expected. So the way you see the hamburger, the way you see the hamburger in the commercial, that's the way you want to eat it, right? Yes. So the same, you want to get what you saw in the commercial. How is the product you sell different from the products of your competitors or of your competition? And Abigail was talking about uh, an entrepreneurship, an entrepreneurship, entrepreneurship. She's running with her sister uh, with digital media. And I asked her, what is better from your product or your service compared to the competitors? And she said something very important. Uh, she said that their job, their job with her sister their job is more detail oriented. So they look into every single detail of the drawings and the customers like that. That's very important. Okay, let's move on. What do we do next? Okay, we have a conversation on page 19. Correct me if I'm wrong. This is on page 19. Um, let me have someone here. Okay, Carla, please, can you read the instruction? Yes. Uh, Diana is applying for a position, let me see, no. uh, for a position in the marketing department. Read an excerpt 
from the interview take turns practicing the conversation. Excellent. Thank you very much, Carla. Okay, let's go with the reading, okay? I'm gonna read it first before I, before I split you in couples. This time you're gonna be in couples. Okay, just listen, pay attention. And if there is a new word, let me know. Let me know. Okay, just write it. If there's a new word, please write it. One second, sorry. Okay. There we go. So, team, let's start with the most important part of the interview. Here's the first question. What are the key elements that warranty the success of the marketing mix? I think you have to target your market. That is, you must define who you are selling to and you need to figure out what they want. If you don't do this, your business will inevitably fail. I repeat, if you don't do this, your business will inevitably fail. Inevitably fail. That's right. Target your market and be sure to understand the four P's. Now, second question. How would you define the marketing mix? Well, to put it plainly, again, well, to put it plainly, the marketing mix is about putting the right product in the right place and time with the right promotion and at the right price to do this well you need to know every aspect of your business plan okay so we're just going to practice some reading right now i'll send you that image right now that excerpt do you have any new words, any phrasal verbs that you saw? Anybody? Hello? Talking to myself. Oh, 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 talking to myself. Oh. What? No? I have a question about the pronunciation uh, inevitably. <laughs> I don't know inevitable inevitably no 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 inevitably inevitably okay inevitably there you go inevitably inevitably plainly 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 yeah plainly what is plainly Hmm? Plan. <laughs> like a planification? <laughs> yes, it has to do with planning. I was Let me find it again. Plainly. Yeah, plainly. No, it has to do with being plain. Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> Think about this. Plainly means claramente. Simplemente, con claridad, francamente. It's, it's, a, it's a synonym of honestly. Okay? That's crazy. Okay, guys, I'm going to split you in couples so you can practice this conversation really quick. Yes, teacher. That's right. Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, so we're going in couples, okay? Let's go. Yes. Yeah. 
Okay, Ricardo, Maria, please accept the invitation. Thank you. Let's go, Maria. Uh, you are Tim and I am Diana. Okay, let's start with the most important part of the interview. Here's the first question. What are the key elements that warranty the success of the marketing mix? I think you have to target your market. That is, you must define who you are selling to and you need to figure, figure, figure. Out, figure out what they want if you don't do, it, do this your business will inability fail that's right target your market and be sure to understand the four p s <laughs> now second question how will you define the marketing mix well to put in plainly the marketing mix is about putting the right products in the right place and time with the right promotions and at the right price to the to do this well you need to know every every aspect of your business plan excellent very good okay hmm okay let me share this with you really quick i like the way you read guy or girls you have to do it one more time really quick Okay, see, um, Saida, you said key, key. Key, key. No. Uh, key. Key. Uh -huh. No, K, key. Key. Key, very good. Okay. And this word, you say, figure it, I'm sorry, figure out. Figure it out. Figure out. There you go, very good, money. Get out. I know. I know this yeah. difficult work. Yeah. Inevitably. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. And this is the four P's. It's like Peace. this is pluralizing the S. The P, I'm sorry. It's pluralizing the P. So peace. So peace. Okay. And here you say plainly. 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 Mm -hmm. And lastly, to do this well, listen, to do this well. To do this well. Quickly, to do this well. To do this well. To do this well. To do this well. Excellent. Very good, girls. Do it one more time. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Keep going. The marketing mix is about putting the right product in the right place and time, with the right promotion, and at the right price. To do this well, you need to know every aspect of your business plan. Aquí la, la palabra reto es esta, inevitably. 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 Repeat again. <laughs> inevitably. 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 Quickly. Inevitably. 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 There you go. Inevitably. 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 You got it, Frank. You got it. Inevitably. 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 Excellent, guys. Good. Okay. Okay, you're doing great. Do it one more time, okay? Okay. okay. I'm going to be. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Chains again. <laughs> you are team now? Okay. Okay. Let's start with the most important part okay. of the interview. 
here's the first question. What are the key elements that warranty the success of the marketing mix? I think you have to target your market. That is, you must define who you are selling to and you need to figure out what they want. If you don't do this, your business will inevitably fail. That's right. Target your market and be sure to understand the four PAs. Now, second question. How will you define the marketing mix? Well, to put in plainly, the market mix is about putting the right product in the right place and time with the right promotion and at the right price. To do this well, you need to know every aspect of your business plan. Woo, very good. Great job. Okay, girls, that was awesome. I'm gonna stop your sharing to share this really quick. Good job, uh, really quick. You said, let's start with the most important, okay, okay this word, key. 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 key, okay. Key. No, it's not K, I know, it's key, key. Key, okay. I know, key. this is a difficult word. Ine yeah. Inevitably. 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 Jacqueline? Inevitably. <laughs> Teacher, uh, pronounce please again. <laughs> Inevitably. Inevitably. Follow, follow me. Inevi. Inevi? Rably. Rably. Inevitably. Uh, Inevitably. Inevitably. There you go. Inevitably. <laughs> It's fall of fail. Fail. The, the fail. 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 Okay. okay. So this is the four P's. P's. Oh, okay. Yeah, the little S, the little S is pluralizing the P. Okay. So peace. Okay. Peace. Well, to put it plainly, well, to put it plainly. Well, to put it plainly. Well, to put it plainly. There you go. Excellent, girls. Great job. Uh, teacher, I have a question. I I didn't get get it about the four create four creating and to create. Is it that's correct? Okay. Uh, yeah. Let, let's clarify that really quick. One word. Okay. I was telling you that four is followed by a noun. Okay. Yeah. Two is followed by a verb. Yeah. So mm -hmm. you can use an ing form. For playing basketball, you need ball. Okay. Uh, okay. Play basketball. See? You need yeah. so four. Uh, for you, it's easy. Okay. Yeah. To me, it's difficult. <laughs> That's another subject. <laughs> Four will always be followed by a noun. Okay. Okay. Let's think about it when, when you speak. Okay. Good. Four okay. Nine. Thank you. Okay. Good. Let's move on. Thank you, teacher. Welcome. Okay, let's move on. I will check the attendance one more time. Hmm, I'm not seeing Jonathan here with us. He didn't make it. Anyhow, let's check the attendance really quick. That's part of our routine. Okay, and again, I have Carla Eugenia Molina Barraza. Here. Thank you. Marvin Jose Aguilar. Here. Thank you. Ricardo Alexander Rodriguez. Here. Thank you. Here. Patricia Alemán. Pati, 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 pati. 
There you go. Thank you. I see you. Is Menia Abigail Trejo? Here. Okay, thank you. Xiomara Hernandez? I'm here. Thank you. Alvin Jose? Yes, I am. Thank you. <laughs> Tamayo? Marilena, stop checking your cell phone. Okay. Here. Here. <laughs> La Paz? Here, teacher. Sorry. Here. Jonathan Alexander is not with us. Ah, oh, Jonathan. Okay. Jacqueline Giovanna. Here. Thank you. Jose Ernesto Molina. A la una. Jose Ernesto Molina. A la dos. No. Okay. Melissa y Beth. Here, teacher. Thank you. Gabriel Alexander. Here, teacher. Here you go. Side. Here. Here. Oh, okay, thank you. Uh, Walter Abraham? Walter, Walter Abraham? No. Hmm. Okay, Francisco Adrián? Here. Frank. Maria Soledad Gomez? Uh, here. here. Vanessa Alexandra? Vanessa, 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 Vanessa? No. Okay, Aleida Raquel? I'm here. Thank you. Okay, guys. Okay, guys, let's move on. I actually had a lot of things prepared for you today, you know, but time runs out really quick. So we're only six minutes. Let's move on with the uh, topic. So after reading this conversation, let me just throw the questions, okay? What does target your market means? What does that mean, target your market? To know for who is your product. For who is your product? Your target, uh, uh, well, the target is uh, of the people objective. Okay. Yeah. The people aim. You're aiming to, a hundred people you're aiming to. Who Do you agree, guys? Francisco, Alida? Give me your own word. How do you say rubro? <laughs> and the target market, uh, I think in my own words, is the, the segments of population. The uh, segment of population. Nice. Nice. Excellent. A segment. A segment of the population, a segment of the market. Alvin, a niche. Niche. A niche. A niche. Just like the 80s, the 80s salsa group, the 80s salsa group. Yes. Nietzsche. Nietzsche. Exactly. Nietzsche. That, that's the spelling, okay, of niche, niche of market. <laughs> okay. What does each of the four P's stand for? What does each of the four Price, promotion, product, uh, price, product and place. Right. Place. <laughs> like place. Okay, girls. Good, Gabriel. You still remember, right? Still remember administration, I like that. Okay, last question. How would you describe the term marketing mix? Is the high connection uh, between price, promotion, product, and price. Excellent, very good. Okay, Melissa, I'll try to repeat, promotion. Promotion. Promote. Promo Look at promo me. Promotion. Promotion. Okay, say mo. Promotion. 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 Shin, shin, shin. Promotion. Shin. Shin. Okay. Like a show. Okay, repeat. Like a show. Shen, shen, shen. Okay, Melissa, try to repeat again. Question. Question. Shen. Shen. Question. 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 Oh, necesito que abra más la boca y que articule. Eh, hoy, después de la clase, quedé haciendo este ejercicio. No. Okay. okay. Abra mucho la boca y cierrela mucho. Y para mañana me trae cinco palabras o verbos que terminen con T-I-O-N. 
T O N promotion distribution distribution question competition okay Fashion. okay <laughs> <laughs> distribution distribution and so on okay just watch Production. watch the video again and you will have the words okay simple okay as okay so that's uh about the marketing mix guys and let me see what time is it yeah we're, we still have time we still have three four minutes so what is the marketing mix what is the target market there's a lot of questions right now what are the four p's i mean clear Oh, but before this, hold on. I want to finish. I rather, I rather finish with new vocabulary for you. So, among these whole words that we have on this conversation, are there any new words for you? New words or phrasal verbs? Yeah. To put it out plainly. Are you out? What? You can put it plainly. Put it plainly, to put it plainly. Okay. Market. Oh, Marina, you're breaking up. Where is my word document? I lost it. God, I'm sorry. Right, guys, I'm trying to find my Word document among all of these things that I have here, and I'm not finding it. God, okay. There it is. Okay, so uh, yeah, you said to put it plainly, to be yeah. to be clear, okay, to be more precise, okay, okay? figure out, okay, this is a separable phrasal verb. You can add an object here. And just by adding this object, it becomes an idiom, a very used idiom in America. You can say, figure it out. Figure it out is like saying, go and find out. Okay. okay. Decode. You can you mm -hmm. decode it. Decode it. Guess. Be, be busca. Yeah, guess it. Guess. It. Figure it out. Adivínalo. Yeah, guess. Imagínalo. It. Imagínalo. Another good one. Good one, Alvin. Mm -hmm. Picture it. Discover. Picture. Discover. It. Exactly. Very Discover good. It. Find out. Decode it. Guessed it, picture it. Okay, what else? What else do you have? What else was there? Marketing is figure it out. Oh, do you understand the term warranty? Warranty. warranty. No, exactly. That's a mistake. Okay. The warranty of a product, Gabriel. The warranty of a product. Warranty. But if I give you my word, I give you my word, I guarantee you, I guarantee you that that is going to work. Uh, an expected thing. Yeah. Creating expectation, exactly, Alvin. Expectation. Okay. Is to feel you is to feel you sure about something. Yeah, exactly. I put my hand in the fire for you. <laughs> exactly. Hold on, what was it? Uh, warranty, yeah, warranty. I warranty you that this is going to work. It's not a warranty. The warranty itself is my word. That's my warranty. A five. Teacher. Yeah. And what about uh, the pronunciation um, in in the in the warranty and warranty? <laughs> is the same pronunciation for the both word? For both words, it's the same pronunciation. Yes. Okay. Oh, yes. yes. Your warranty. Okay. Warranty is, is like, I promise you. I promise you, exactly. Okay. Figure it out. Inevitably. Inevitably. I don't like that word. I give my word. Inevitably. Okay. Inevitable. Inevitably. 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 
mente. mente. Yeah, this is what makes mente inevitable. Listen, inevitable. Inevitable. Inevitably is inevitablemente. Exactly. So one is an adjective and the other one is a. Uh, I forgot the name of this thing. Hold on. I forgot the substantive. I can remember. Okay, and inevitable and fijo and yeah, something like that. I, I'll owe you that. Okay, so adjective and the end of the word, <laughs> something like that. Yeah, no, it's something like that. Um, you have adjective irregular. No, no. stop it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that L-Y equals, in Spanish, that mente, okay? Yeah. Frequent, uh, adverb, it's an adverb. It makes an adverb, an adjective, an adverb, okay? So, fast. Faster. Fastly. Fastly. Yeah. Rapidamente. Yeah, and it's so on. Quickly. Quick, quickly, yeah, okay? Smart, smartly, and so, so, so on, so on. Okay, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Please continue practicing. Today's homework, if I were you, if I were you, um, tomorrow I will be studying comparatives and superlatives. Comparatives and superlatives, okay? Okay. Hey, hey teacher. Okay, hey, teacher. Tomorrow, make sure you add comments on the discussion forum underneath this video, okay? Marilena, okay. You have a question? Marilena? Good? Okay. okay, good. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Good night. Good night. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night sweetheart. Good night, everyone.